Hey everybody, it's Bex. I'm bringing you my February Nocturnal Readers Box unboxing. I'm super stoked about it. Let's go. Of all the boxes in the world, pizza boxes, donut boxes, those weird little boxes that you put cupcakes in, of all of those, this is my favorite box. This box is for everyone who loves creepy things, and I am one of them, so let's do this. First up, this super cute notebook. I'm gonna fill it with evil plans and hit lists and things of that evil nature. <laughs> There's a quote on the front that says, strange how paranoia can link up with reality now and then. Pretty intriguing, and if you didn't catch on by that, February's theme was paranoia, so apt choice. Every box comes with two books, and I am stoked about what I found in here this time. First up, is Under a Watchful Eye by Adam Neville. I'm sure I'm saying his last name wrong, sorry. <laughs> I'm not gonna ramble on about the book description, but I will leave it below, and I'm just gonna say that it sounds amazing. Screw my TBR stack, I might go straight to this one. Hmm, I thought this was a book, and it is, but it's a lie. It's a lie, children, it's all a lie. Well, it's a cool lie. <laughs> it's actually a box that looks like a book, that holds a book, so I mean, it's like Inception in box form. I can't, this was not a coordinated attempt. Forgive me. So this is a sneaky book box. It sounds like a perfect place to hide important things like, you know, candy and any of your evil plots that you've been working on, if you're a villain, which of course I am, at least in this video. Pretending to be Silence of the Lambs, on the inside you have that ridiculously creepy moth that I just love slash hate. You can't blame me, it's really creepy. Ah! The book inside the book box of the book box. Inception, I'm telling you. American Psycho, which I have always actually meant to read, but I never did because I'm a slacker. So now I don't have any more excuses. I'm gonna read it. I'm stoked about getting this. It's a classic, you know? Hold on, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna look really quick on it. Can you just hang on? I'm just gonna look for a second. Just hold, hold please. A lot of you know how much I already love the Nocturnal Readers Box pins. They make the best pins. I know that sounds insane, but they really do. Everything in this box is always so well curated. I can't get over how much quality there is in everything. It blows my mind. So this month's cute little pin is not cute. I'm sorry, it's not cute. It's creepy and terrifying. Cut the cute part. This is an American Psycho reference, so those of you who are familiar with the book or the film will get it, but it's a little VHS tape, and if you don't know what a VHS tape is, I'm sorry, but it's a VHS tape, and there's a little quote on there that says, I have to return some videotapes, and I think that you know what that means. Also, it's dripping blood, so, oh my god, you guys on it today. <laughs> the, the amazingness of this is that not only is the pin super cool, but the way they put this box together is so funny because the little paper that the pin comes on, you know, obviously this is kind of just like a product container, really, is a business card for Patrick Bateman, which is the main character in American Psycho, and it's just perfect. It's perfect. Who thinks of that? They do, because they're amazing. I love it. I seriously love them. Super cute sunglasses. I hope I can pull them off. So as the theme for February was paranoia on the side here, it actually says, don't follow me. I hope you can read it. Now I feel like one of those cool people who wear sunglasses inside. You know? Why do people do that? <laughs> can someone explain that to me? <laughs> Whatever, I feel cooler. Maybe it works, I don't know. Another thing that I love about the Nocturnal Readers box is that they always include original artwork, which I think is so funky and fun, and it's always creepy and delightful. And this time, they choose an illustrator. Hold on, I'll find her name for you. This one is by Renee Postma. 
I have already checked out the Instagram account behind it and whoa, it is so cool and creative. I was kind of blown away, so I'm excited to have one of her prints. Very cool. You can't have a book box without a bookmark, am I right? So they always have some funky little creepy one and I think this is so funny and it's definitely going to be keeping my place in American Psycho when I read it. So cute. Cute in a terrifying way. So next month's box for March is going to be Lost in the Woods as the theme. I'm excited about March because March is my birthday month and I'm getting a Nocturnal Readers box so it's like a present for myself and I am stoked. <laughs> This is the box for fans of horror, sci-fi, and thrillers. It just, it doesn't get better. I friggin' I love this box. I love it. Give us a minute. So if you want to join us horror fanatics and you're ready to take the plunge and get this box, which you totally should, by the way, just click the more button on my little description box below. There's going to be a link to the order form on the Nocturnal Readers box website. And if you use my code NOCTURNALBEX, you actually get 15% off, so you're welcome. That's it guys, if you're still curious about this box, I have a few other unboxings below, and I will post some over here on the YouTube machine. I'm so excited for March, so I'll see you guys for another Nocturnal Readers Box unboxing then. Alright, bye!